Hey, this is Tyler Beck with Autodesk. Today, I wanna to take you through product development within Fusion Lifecycle. And the product itself is really just a top-down view of everything that goes into launching a product, whether it's all the details, the build materials, tasks, milestones, attachments, everything. Let's look at it. I wanna show how Fusion Lifecycle can be used to manage development deliverables. Let's start by navigating to the product's workspace. This is found in the product development category. Comprehensive information on the product, its current status, its development process is all summarized here across these tabs. So beginning with details, you can get a glance of all the pertinent information to the product. The summary, the marketing info for the product features, images, and the product team that's responsible for the sign-off. Let's take a look at the Bill Materials tab. Here you can view the top-level Bill Materials for the entire product and a link to the underlying Bill Materials along with its revisions, life cycle history, changes, and attachments. You can compare the top-level Bill Materials to another product or you can view the release of the Bill Materials by date. You can also export the entire bill materials here with the zip tool. Under the tasks and deliverables tab, you can see the entire timeline laid out. This is complete with start and end dates, current status, and percent complete. And these are all links that go back to the actual tasks workspace. The status column reflects not only the workflow state, but the milestone state based on the due date of those individual tasks. And this provides any stakeholders a bird's eye view of everything that's needed to get the product to launch. The product's workspace also provides an interactive workflow map. And this gives you visibility with a graphical representation of your design process. Starting from requirements to testing or control runs, you can also show an obsolete status. Sign-offs and approvals are all viewable here in the workflow history on the right, or you can view them in the product team section. Product milestones reflect the projected target date of the workflow state found in the workflow tab. And this is represented in loud green, yellow, and red. So you can understand the status at a glance. Milestones are tied to the workflow states seen here, and these update in real time. These milestones can also be seen by the individual. If you go to your home page, you'll find your outstanding work. This displays the milestone status, its color on the flag, and a link to the existing record. Once the milestones are created and set, we can edit the individual date or shift them all at once. The attachments workspace houses all the files and the data that pertains to the product. These are trackable with check-in and check-out capabilities. Also included are shortcuts to every related record, like the bill materials or change requests. In summary, the new product introduction workspace within Fusion Lifecycle is excellent for covering everything above and beyond the bill materials.